Hey guys, today I'm bringing you my May TBR. I'm a little worried about doing this since I don't know if I can set to a planned set of books to read, but we'll see. We'll see how many I get through or if I stray from this list. I'm going to try and read The Spectacular Now by Tim Tharp. I'm hoping this will just be an easy read after my sad book that I just read. That's why I'm looking forward to this one. Another book is Where'd You Go, Bernadette by Maria Semple. It takes place in Seattle and I think it makes fun of the different parts and people of Seattle, which is where I live, so I really want to read this one. This is the one I'm probably most excited for, which is Norwegian Wood by Haruki Murakami. I'm always looking for more books about people in their 20s, mid-20s, young 20s, whatever. And so I'm excited to read this one, which takes place in like the 60s, I believe. And I still have never read a Murakami book, so I need to get on it. This book is a short one by Jean-Paul Sartre, I'm gonna say, but it is The Chips Are Down. It is super short and like the margins are really big so I'm sure I'll get through it really fast. I've heard that if you like to read philosophy then this is a good book to read, a good fiction to read. The last book is A Confederacy of Dunces by John Kennedy Toole. I've also heard this book is hilarious, it takes place in the south so I'm sure that I'll like it because of that. The character is obnoxious and sarcastic and an annoying person so it looks pretty funny. Also, the backstory of this author is pretty interesting. I believe he committed suicide because he couldn't get the book published, and after he died, his mom went around and chopped his book to a professor, and it ended up becoming a Pulitzer Prize winner after he died. Those are the books for the month of May that I hope to read, and I'd like to see what your guys' books are. Thanks for watching. Bye.